So guys, the Shadow Keep DLC arrives on September 17th, which is around 9 weeks from the creation of this video. But do you guys want to explore an area I believe will arrive officially with the next DLC major expansion for D2? If so, stay tuned. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you enjoy it, leaving a like truly helps out and subscribe if you want more Daily Destiny 2 videos. Okay, so the Shadow Keep DLC. We know partially what this DLC arrives with. Well, actually, do we? Well, we know the moon is coming back and along with many old foes resurrected. But that's really about it. From Guardian Con, which is not long ended, we got a little more info about the next major DLC, which included information on the next season, which arrives alongside the Shadow Keep, namely Season of the Undying. Now, this isn't new information, and it's been in plain sight from the arrival of Opulence via the director. It's said all along the Season of the Undying is the next season to the game. Now at Guardian Con, Bungie did release this road map which showcases well one season and three other blank seasons. But there's no information really within this picture. What's mysterious though is how the next season seems to be based around Vex. But if this season is coming alongside the Shadow Keep, how does this make sense? What is this all about? Well during the next season, Season of the Undying, there will be a Vex outbreak across the entire solar system. And this is new information coming out of Guardian Con. So across the entire solar system there will be Avex take over. Sounds pretty cool. And this is why yours truly has put two and two together and brought you today's video. Now the area today I'm glitching into isn't new. My pal Mighty Life Crisis uploaded this last month. But because the area is literally like a placeholder area, full of uh, weird Guardian renders and more, not many people covered it. Mighty's channel can be found linked within the video description if you do want to check him out and show him some love. But this area, after I had a proper look at it, I can confirm that this area is in fact that of something we have experienced in Destiny's past. You guys remember the Nexus Strike from Destiny 1, where we fought through hordes of Vex enemies fighting our way to Secrian, Nexus Mind? This is that area, just redesigned slightly. You can see the similarities on screen now, although like I said it looks like it's in its early design stages. We can see that the area and what it consists of is very much of that what we experience from the Nexus Mind Strike. One major difference though is that there's actually taken balls all over the place. So when this strike returns, or mission as it could be a mission indeed, but when this returns, can we expect changes of a taken nature? Well people it does seem that way. Could this also be clues into the next season, and what comes along with this Vex invasion? But we will see. But people it does seem that way, that this will be of a taken themed mission or strike. Also very interesting to think about is the Undying Mind Strike, which when started, starts you in the Black Garden area. An area we know is returning with the new raid, when Shadowkeep arrives. So maybe that will be another area within the Undying Mind Strike that we will revisit. Now it's starting to make sense as when we first got, I believe it was at E3, when we first got glimpses and teases of Shadowkeep, yes we saw that the moon was coming back, we also saw news that the Black Garden area was returning with a new raid, but we couldn't put two and two together, because the moon and the Black Garden area are literally two different parts of the game we already know. But with this next season being called the Season of the Undying, and we now know that there will be a Vex takeover, a Vex invasion, it does start to make sense. Now the Nessa strike on D1 was within the Mars Director. To glitch into this area, it's done from IO. And if you guys want to go here and explore this area, follow the route I take shortly. So the season of the Undying arrives on September 17th alongside the Shadow Keep DLC and it consists of a possible takeover by the Vex. On screen now you can see the area you have to go to on IO to glitch into this new area which I believe comes alongside the Shadow Keep. It's easiest to do on a Titan with those Lion Rampants using a sword, but it's possible to do on the Warlock and Hunter also, guys. 
So people, is the Nexus Strike coming back with the Shadow Keep DLC? Well it does seem that way for sure but only time will tell. Let me know your opinion on this down below within that comment section people but on that note we have come to the end. If you guys enjoyed it leaving a like really does help out. If you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys explore the area. If you find anything interesting, let me know. I have had a look around, haven't found any lore or anything like that, just in case you are wondering. But guys, enjoy the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.
Huh. <laughs> 